You sure? I was 17 and my body changed seemingly overnight. Flesh and blood and raging hormones. So intense. It's like primal. Oh, God, that's so hot! That boy next door, do you love him? It's none of your business. But then, one night that summer, everything changed. I actually grew up in a small town right outside of LA that was very suburban and, and very um, cookie cutter as far as its architecture and its design. And so I definitely related to the white picket fence, everything seems fine internally and yet, or externally, and yet once you get to the depth internally, everything's um, all over the place. Dude, dude. Have you met yet? No. My movies have always been really interested in dreams and surreal and the sort of visual stylization of that. And so that's why this book was so sort of like a perfect fit for me because it is really about um, it, that dreaminess and that surrealism has been in all my movies. Yeah, I dream heavily. Um, not, not necessarily often, but in spurts. And... Uh, I wish it informed me in, in my acting as much as, you know, instead it sort of just frightens the hell out of me. No, I don't dream. You don't dream? No, I, that's just sad. Um, but it's interesting you say that because that's how I felt the, what the sensibility of this movie was. It was a constant kind of dreamscape. I do dream and I love dreaming and I feel like, you know, the thing with dreaming is it's sort of like death. They're the two things that we can't really explain as human beings, you know, because we'll have I have no way to ever prove it and no way to ever have a, 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 a thick grasp of what it actually means. So I think it's fun to play the dream game and the death game of thinking, what, what, imagining what might happen. <laughs> Please, I don't care what it is. I just cannot keep living my life in the dark just wondering. Don't ask me. Ask him. Why won't anyone listen to me? Mom? The beautiful woman she once was became a phantom wandering away in a snowstorm.